Yeah, it's been a while since I've made a video. Um, I just, uh, I guess I just had a miscarriage or whatever. Cause, and it's crazy because, like, you know, I consider myself, oh, hashtag baby killer or whatever. Like, I wouldn't have had it even if it, if, if it went through, but it was just like, just to wake up in a pool of blood and, and in so much pain and it's just like, I, I can't deal with the stress. And then I call the dad that would have been dead and of course he doesn't never answer the phone as he ever answers the phone, he never does. But on top of that I'm dealing with the fact that I got a tear in my hip and you know, my leg's still in pain, and I may gotta use surgery again, and it's just like, I don't need this. <laughs> I don't need a miscarriage also on my conscience, you know? Like, I'm like, oh, maybe it's stress, or maybe it's something else, but... <laughs> You know, I already came on my period already this month, you know, and then I had sex. And then he says, I'm like, oh, I think I'm in you, but, you know, I didn't, you know, I thought, you know, he didn't, you know, so I didn't take, think nothing of it or whatever. But then, like a week later, my boobs were hurting and I, I just started it to feel, not feel, I felt like my period was coming on or something. So I'm like, dad, why the heck my boobs and stuff? I mean, it was really hurting too, especially my one on the left side. So I'm thinking, oh my God, maybe it's, but the lumps in my breasts finally, you know, you know, maybe the can they cancerous and they cause they're causing pain or something, you know, because I still haven't gotten that checked out yet. So, but then I woke up today and like, <sighs> I haven't seen that much blood, and then like these big clogs of this stuff. But it was just like, it was like, I didn't have, it was like the choice was made for me. And I guess because I take 20 different pills for pain and nerves and anxiety and depression that maybe that's what did it. I don't know, but I just know that. And I just wish the, the dude would just flip an answer or call me back, but he probably wouldn't believe me anyway. Probably like, oh, you're just having two periods in a month or whatever. Like, so. But it's just like. I was just saying, I got like a couple of weeks ago how, like, all the, then I just found out about this tear that I gotta get my 11th MRI on, by the way, which I go next week. The tear in my hip. They're like, oh, you must have had that since you were born. Like, everything I had since I was born. So I started to wonder, like, dad, my mom used to wish I wasn't born, so maybe she was right. Like, maybe I shouldn't have been born. You know, I started to feel that way. And then now to go through this is like. Punishment? Am I being punished? Like, oh, okay. Oh, you, you think you wish she wasn't born? Okay, so I'm gonna make sure that you have a miscarriage. So, <laughs> and, you, and you gotta feel the pain of that alone. <laughs> so. Thank God I'm on my like antidepressant and freaking anxiety medication because I think of killing myself and dying and I have a person in my head who wants to kill me and I have to keep her locked away in a room, Mrs. Davis. 
I have to keep her locked away in her room. But stuff like this can trigger her to get in control. So, I'm about to do what I always do, self-medicate because I can't know how to help myself normally. I mean, I talked to my counselor about it, we researched it just to make sure, like, I'm not going crazy, like, you know, like, okay, you know, young girls always have their periods and two periods and a month, full periods and stuff, whatever, you know, and then you start Googling it, and then I'm like, okay, well, it's only been, like, maybe like a week and a half since I had sex. Oh, can, it, can you get pregnant that fast? Or, you know, and yeah, everybody's body is different, you know, and obviously I'm super fertile. <laughs> I thought I was it, but I guess I'm super fertile. And so like a drop of cum, nigga. <laughs> but at the end of the day, I wouldn't have kept it anyway. So it's like, Hey, just help me out, I guess. So, you know, hashtag baby killer, hashtag you gotta now do but your, but your body killing it on its own. Like, you didn't even have a choice to. <laughs> and I was saying, like, dang, I'm not gonna have any kids because I'm too jacked up in the head to have a kid, you know, like. I can't raise no baby. I am mentally insane. <laughs> as well as I got all these problems and I don't want to be the wise baby mama. So I was like, I didn't want no kids anyway for that reason. But it's just, I never expected to have a miscarriage. Like, I didn't, like, that was the last thing I expected to happen. So I'm just, and then the pain, like, 